Hi, and welcome to the University of Hrvde. My name is Karin Jonengård, and I work at the international, international Office as an International Coordinator. This is my colleague, Ryan. Please introduce yourself. Hi, I'm Ryan. I also work at the International Office uh, as an International Recruiter. And we're going to give you a short introduction to the University of Hrvde. First of all, we would like to share this really nice video of our university. Uh, so just hang on, and here it comes. In the northern part of Europe, you'll find one of the most innovative countries in the world, Sweden. With just over 10 million inhabitants, Sweden is at the forefront in areas such as IT, industry, green technology, and life science. Sweden also has a great reputation when it comes to music production and game development. The capital of Sweden is Stockholm. It was founded in the 13th century, and it is one of the most beautiful capitals in the world. Just a few minutes away from Stockholm, you'll discover an astonishing archipelago with over 30,000 islands. Thanks to its geographic location, all four seasons are very distinguished. In the northern parts of Sweden, during the summer, the sun never sets, and during winter, the snow depth often reaches over one meter. The Swedish spring offers a cavalcade of flowering fields, and in the autumn, vibrant colors in the trees make for a beautiful sight. With just a two-hour train ride from Stockholm, or one hour from Sweden's second largest city, Gothenburg, you'll find Hovde, just beside the mountain, Bilingen. Nestled between Sweden's two largest lakes, in an area full of historical heritage and beautiful surroundings. There are an abundance of nature experiences and wonderful sights just around the corner. Hovde has about 60,000 inhabitants and has a warm and pleasant city center with a variety of restaurants, cafes, and shopping venues. There are also plenty of green areas, and in one of the city parks, you will even find a swimming lake. Hovde is one of the leading game development cities in the world. A number of successful studios with world-famous games operate here. The city is also internationally known for its manufacturing industry. The University of Hovde is located in the city center, just a five-minute walk from the train station. The university has a beautiful and green campus that showcases a welcoming and modern study environment that features an aesthetic that blends buildings that are more than 100 years old with cutting edge technology and accessibility. It doesn't take more than a couple of minutes to get from one side to the other, and all of the university's student accommodations are within walking distance from the university campus. The university was established in 1977 and has about 9,000 students and is specialized within these areas. One of the university's distinct advantages is the close connections between students, teachers, and even local industry. At the university, there is a student union that primarily works to ensure that students have an active influence over their study situation. They also organize social activities for the students and run a pub and nightclub just a few minutes walk from the campus where student dinner parties and many other activities are held. The research at the university aims to make a difference locally, nationally, as well as internationally. That is why research efforts are carried out in tight collaboration with the community. The university is one of five worldwide preferred research partners of Volvo Group.
Adjacent to the university, you will find Science Park Hufta. It is a technology and research park that binds academy, business, and society together. One of these collaborations is Sweden Game Arena, which is one of the most advantageous development environments within the international computer games industry. It consists of over 200 game developers and over 500 game students and has been an important part of the Swedish games industry for several years. Another great example of collaboration between academia and industry is ASAR Industrial Innovation Arena, which offers manufacturing and technology companies a world-class innovation environment to provide new solutions for the future. The University of Hufta has always strived for excellence. Every decision, every achievement has emerged from a focus on creating first-class education and internationally competitive research that makes a difference to society. Welcome to the University of Hufta. Well, that was a short introduction to our university. And Ryan, you came here from the US. Please tell us why you choose to live in this beautiful city of Hövde. Well, in Swedish, there's the word lagom, which is like not too much, not too little, just the perfect amount in the middle, Goldilocks zone, so to speak. Uh, and I think that Hövde is very much that uh, here in Southern Sweden. We're about halfway between the two uh, biggest cities in Sweden, the capital Stockholm and Gothenburg. Uh, we're also halfway between the two biggest lakes, uh, so it's a good place to go spend your summers and go swim and hang out with friends. And we also happen to be about halfway in between our neighbors' capitals, Oslo and Copenhagen. It's really a great location, uh, and Sweden itself is a great country, especially if you're interested in any of the sciences, because this country dedicates so much of its uh GDP to research and development. Uh, it really stands out despite being so small with a disproportional impact in the innovative industries. And yeah, here are just some short information about the university. We were established in 1977 by an act of the Swedish government for a public university. And uh, yeah, as you can see here, here are some pictures from a beautiful campus. And uh, it's very, Ryan, you really like the different seasons here, don't you? Yeah, I, I think that Sweden has just incredibly vibrant and different seasons. Uh, so you can see pictures here of the fall, winter, spring, and summer. And each of them is just so different and, and so unique uh, and really, in my opinion, so pleasant. Uh, it makes Sweden a great place to be. Yeah, and as you can see here, here are our the buildings of the university. Some of them are actually old military buildings that, of course, have been updated with new decor. And we have the best IT service uh, in all the facilities with Wi-Fi and so on. So no worries about that. We also have a couple of new buildings as well. And just some short statistics about the University of Hövde. Uh, we have about 11,000 students. We have 550 staff with two-thirds being academic staff. We have about 60 study programs within bachelor, master's, PhD. We also work very uh, innovative and cross-disciplinary due to the fact that we're a very specialized university. So we have only five schools, but they wor work very closely. We have 25 programs that are fully taught in English, 23 of uh, 22 of them being in um, uh, our master's programs and three of them are bachelor programs and they are in English. We have about international agreements with over 130 university. We have about 360 incoming international students as well as 60 outgoing exchange students. And here you can see the picture of our vice chancellor Lars Niklasson. And Ryan, just a short introduction to where the university is located in the city. Yeah, so uh, everything here in Hravda is very much in walking distance of each other. Here you can see our campus. All of the academic buildings outlined in blue are very close together. It doesn't take more than five minutes to walk across campus. Actually, our student housing is just outside of this image, but it's also only about a five minute walk to get to campus from most of our student housing. Over on the right side, you can see Science Park Hravda, which is a tech 
uh, park with a whole lot of small and medium businesses. And then in the pink area, you can see the joint area for research and innovation, which is where we take kind of those businesses and our academic staff and we put them in the same place, uh, co-locate them and let them uh, work off of each other's resources. And so for the industry, this leads to a lot of uh, good new ideas from the students. And for the students, it means a lot of networking opportunities with the people who are relevant in the fields that they're trying to get jobs in once they graduate. Yeah, thank you, Ryan. And we just need to highlight as well that um, Hövde is the commercial center of this region called Skara Boy. We have a lot of large as well as medium sized and small sized companies. One of our, uh, our bigger companies are Volvo Cars and Trucks that the university has collaboration with. We are also one of Volvo's preferred partners within a research partner within a sp very specific area as well. And just some short introduction to the different uh, programs. We have um, international programs in bioscience. Three of them are within bachelors. They are in, in biomedicine, uh, bioscience, molecular biodesign, and molecular bioinformatics. We also have master programs within uh, bioinformatics, biomarkers in molecular medicine, cognitive neuroscience, mind and brain, infection biology, molecular biotechnology, system biology with specialization in bioinformatics. We have both one and two year master programs. For more information, you can check out our QR codes that you can see here and our website, of course. We also have a couple of international programs in informatics in master both one year and two year masters. They are data, within data science, privacy information and cybersecurity, digital narration, game and culture heritage, game development, games, user experience, as well as serious games. And we also have um, three master programs, both one year and two year masters within engineering. And they are computational methods in engineering, intelligent automation, virtual ergonomics and design. We also have international programs in business, uh, a master uh, in leadership and organization development. Uh, this is a one year master that is going, we will start up from the semester of 2023, the autumn 2023. And we also offer uh, for our fee paying students, Swedish courses for free if they are taken within the first year of the studies. One of them are um, about the Swedish society and the Swedish culture. And the other one is Swedish for foreign students, where you will get some basic, um, yeah, talking and listening. And Ryan, how much does it cost to act to study here? Uh, well, uh, for EU students and EEA, uh, or, or students within the EU or EEA, uh, you don't pay any tuition fees. However, for us who are coming from outside of the EU or EEA, uh, it's 135,000 Swedish crowns per year. So for two-year programs, that's uh, 270,000 Swedish crowns. And for a three-year bachelor's, it's 405 Swedish crowns. Uh, these are paid in installments before every semester of 67,500 Swedish crowns. These come out to around 6,500 euros per payment per semester. Uh, and then for our business degree uh it's actually a little bit cheaper uh, only ninety five thousand swedish crowns for the full year uh and that comes out to uh, uh semester payments of forty seven thousand five hundred swedish crowns generally living here uh is going to cost you around 800 to a thousand euros you can see a little breakdown of how you are likely to spend your money here uh one thing that I like to note on this slide is that the local travel here in Havda is not really a thing. These are estimates from across Sweden. Uh, here, everything is walking distance. So you can take that money and put it towards your food budget and eat a little bit tastier food. Uh, our accommodation is tends to be right around the 3,900. Uh, we have uh, four different accommodation areas ranging between 3,000 to 4,000 Swedish crowns uh, for for students here and we also uh, offer uh, or actually you can apply for one of our own scholarship it's the um, the university of Hövde's master scholarships however that's only for master students but it covers about 50 percent of the tuition fee a uh, scholarships holder needs to cover the remaining fee and other living expenses as mentioned, only available for master applicants who apply on time via university admission and choose Hövde as their first option. 
and it's open for application now it opened in october and it's open until the first of february if you're planning to come and study here in august the autumn intake for 2023 and just some short deadlines uh, you apply through the university admission sc and the application deadline is on the 16th of january a document uh, the deadline for document submission is the first of february and you also have to um, pay your application fee deadline for so that university uh, university mission will look into your application and that's also the first of february and the notification for this selection results if you're planning to come this autumn is the uh, 30th of March 2023 uh, if you're a master student and if you're a bachelor student it's the 5th of April 2023. We also offer our introduction program that will start on the 21st of August 2023 and the first program meeting is going to be on the 28th of August 2023. And yeah please meet us online we have a couple of recordings from webinars we have had where you will meet our students as well as our program directors and you can hear them talking and describing the programs as well as we answering questions about it and you will get a longer introduction to the University of Kravda as well and we also have student ambassadors that you can send an email to and chat if you want to know about their experience about being a student here at the university you can see the qr code and then you can just get in touch with them through our website and yeah if you have any questions you can just send us an email at study at his.se so thank you